In this video, I'm going to show you how to clear the system software cache on your PS5 in safe mode, which can fix performance drops and system feature issues. So the first thing you want to do is turn off your PS5. You can press the button on your console, or you can just navigate to power and go to turn off PS5. Now, in the meantime, you can grab your USB cable that came with your PS5. You can plug it into the front and you want to grab this end and put it into your controller. So we'll go ahead and do that now while the PS5 is turning off. So once that's plugged in, just wait for the lights to stop flashing, which they have. So now I'm going to press and hold the power button on the console and we're going to wait for a beep, which takes about five seconds. So we'll wait for it now. So boom, there we go. Just like that. Now this is going to bring us into safe mode and it's going to ask us to press the PlayStation button on our controller. So we're going to do that now. And from here, you'll see option number six, clear cache and rebuild database. Select this one and from here, go to clear system software cache. So once we go to OK, this process does not take long. We're talking a couple of minutes tops. And this, according to PlayStation support, can fix performance drops on your console just by deleting some of this active memory that could be potentially taking up space. So the more applications and games you play, the greater re the results may be from actually doing this. So hopefully this video was helpful. Like and subscribe and we'll see you in the next one.